Let's go to 3a. A function f is uh, defined by f of x equals k times e to the x over second power over 1 plus e to the x power, where x is all real numbers, x is greater than or equal to 0, and k is positive real numbers. The region enclosed by the graph of f of x, the x-axis, the y-axis, and the line x equals natural log of 16 is rotated 360 about the x-axis to form a solid revolution. Show that the volume of the solid formed is 15 k square pi over 36 cubic units. From a formula booklet, the volume of a revolution about x axis is this formula. Volume equals integral from A to B pi y square dx equals integral from 0 to natural log of 16 pi k e x over second power 1 plus e to the x power then square dx constant number is a k square pi integral from 0 to natural log of 16 of 1 plus e to the x power e to the x over second power square dx. Organize k square pi integral from 0 to natural log of 16 1 plus e to the x power square e to the x over 2 second power will be e to the x power dx since 1 plus e to the x power prime equals e to the x power. Integral from 0 to natural log of 16. 1 plus e to the x power to the negative second power times e to the x power dx. Then we can use this formula. f of x to the nth power f of prime of x dx equals f of x to the n plus 1 power over n plus 1 plus c. k square pi bracket 1 plus e to the x power negative first power over negative 1. from 0 to natural log of 16. We will take a negative 1 outside, negative k squared pi, then 1 over 1 plus e to the x power from 0 to natural log of 16. So we get negative k squared pi. 1 over 1 plus e to the natural log of 16 minus 1 over 1 plus e to the 0 power equals 
negative k square pi. This is a 16. 1 plus 16 is a 1 over 17 minus 1 over 2. Organize. It will be 15 over 34 k square pi. Pedro wants to make a small bowl with a, a volume of 300 cm cubed based on the result from part A. Pedro's design is shown in the following diagrams. The vertical height of the bowl BO is measured along the x-axis. The radius of the bow's top is OA, and the radius of the bow's base is BC. All lengths are measured in centimeters. Find the K that satisfies the requirements of Pedro's design. Since volume equals 300, and a 15 over 34 k square pi equals 300. Then we can solve for k. Let's use the equation solver. 15 over 34 k square pi minus 300 equals 0. By solver. Let's go to y1. 15 divided by 34 x square pi minus 300 quit math equation solver for this k is a positive let's estimate as a 5 alpha Enter. Answer is 14.7. 14.7 centimeters. Let's go to 3C. Find OA. We know OA equals F of 0. That equals K over 2. Go to calculator. We got k equals 14.7122. So quit. X, enter, then divided by 2. X equals 7.36. Let's go to 3D. Find BC. BC equals F of natural log of 16 that equals let's put a function into y1 then quit alpha trees y1 natural log 16 enter 3.46 so BC equals 3.46 centimeters. Don't forget the unit. Let's go to 3E. For design purpose, Pedro investigates how the cross-sectional radius of the bowl changes by sketching the graph of a suitable derivative of f of x. Find where the cross-sectional radius of the bow is decreasing most rapidly. Decreasing most rapidly, which means the minimum of f prime of x, or zero of f double prime of x. We need to sketch the graph of a suitable derivative of f. So you can either sketch the graph f prime of x or f double prime of x. 
So we put uh, f function into y1, the first derivative function into y2, the second derivative function into y3. We only highlight uh, y2, then graph. You could see this is the graph, and a minimum value is uh, here. So we go to second trace, go to three. Left bound uh, is a uh, zero. Enter, then move the cursor to the right. Make sure the cursor is uh, on the right side of this uh, minimum value. Enter, enter, x equals 1.76. If you want to use a second derivative function, let's uh, unhighlight this uh, y2, then highlight this uh, y3. Graph. For second derivative function, we are looking for the x-intercept. Change the window. We only change the minimum from negative 1 to 1. Then graph again. This time, we could see this uh, zero very clearly. Second trace, go to two. Left bound, let's uh, do one. Enter, then move the cursor to the right. Enter, enter. We get the same answer, x equals 1.76. So if you want to use uh, the first uh, derivative function, you will draw the graph uh, like this. When you draw the graph, well, make sure you have to label origin, x and y. If you want to use the second derivative uh, function, the graph uh, will be like this. Make sure you label origin, x and y. 3f, state the cross-sectional radius of the ball at this point. Basically, we are looking for f of 1.76 equals, then press x, enter, alpha trace, y1, it's the function. Then drop this down. Enter. Answer is a 5.20 centimeters. So radius is a 5.20 centimeters.